volunteers in California and other western states are registering Hispanic voters ahead of the election. This group, Voto Latino, is a nonpartisan organization, but both major parties are working to attract these newly registered voters. In Orange County, California, the Democratic incumbent, Congressional Member Loretta Sanchez, wants to mobilize Hispanics while also reaching out to other ethnic groups. Most Hispanics in California are registered Democrats, and Sanchez is the daughter of Mexican immigrants. But there's concern that some Hispanics may sit out this election, so Sanchez got help at a recent rally from former President Bill Clinton. You come up with the same answer, Loretta Sanchez, every single time. You go tell people that, and she'll have a great night election night. Thank you, and God bless you all. The seven-term congresswoman is locked in a tight race with a Vietnamese immigrant, Republican Van Tran. Tran is getting help from prominent Republicans, including former Alaska governor and vice presidential candidate Sarah Palin. And we will get on the right track. Tran was born in Vietnam and has wide support among Vietnamese immigrants like high school student Vivian Lee. Because I think he's good and he's a great guy and I think a lot of changes, 14 years you have to go like step up and then Ben Tran have to come. We need change. Orange County has large numbers of Latinos and the highest concentration of Vietnamese immigrants in the United States and Republicans hope to get support from both groups. Tran says he understands the district's Hispanics. I have more in common as a first generation immigrant uh, with the Latino community uh, than my opponent. You know, I understand about the difficulties and the challenges of the assimilation process, the cultural gap or the language gap, and all the challenges uh, for families uh, who wanted to, of course, assimilate and contribute back to their new country. Democrat Sanchez says she appeals across ethnic lines because of her record. The Vietnamese Americans here have the same issues that the rest of the community does. Uh, they, they own small businesses, they don't have health care for their people, uh, people aren't spending as much money, many of them have had to close, so I've been talking to them about the 16 bills that we passed with respect to small business. Tran has accused Sanchez of using race to boost support among Hispanic voters. Sanchez said last month on Spanish language television that the Republicans and the Vietnamese are trying to take away her seat and she called her opponent anti-immigrant and anti-Hispanic. She later apologized for the remark. Some in the district say they do not vote along ethnic lines. Both parties say at a time of voter frustration they must mobilize to win and generate enthusiasm in the remaining days before the November 2nd election. Mike O'Sullivan, VOA News, Orange County, California. Exactly. Thank you so much for your Hello, support. Hello, this is sir. William Crumlin. You have a wonderful day. Hello, William. My name is